Samsung Electronics has announced a new set of guidelines on its online bulletin board on Wednesday. The announcement said from February 1st, all employees are expected to call each other by their initials or English names without using their formal job titles like Kwajang or Teddy, which are Korean for manager and assistant manager. And when calling someone by their Korean name, all they have to do is add the Korean honorific ending name, which means Mr. or Miss, to remain respectful. Now, Samsung has already been doing this since 2017 to promote a more horizontal work culture. But now, the same rule has officially extended to top-level executives, including Samsung Air and Executive Chairman Lee Jae-yong, who will now go by either JY or J. And in Korean, instead of Hwajang-nim, which means Mr. Chairman, his staff can now call him Jae-yong-nim. For the past several years, Samsung has been trying to reform its rigid corporate culture, which was seen as hampering productivity and open communication among employees. And in 2017, the company made big changes to its job ranking system by simplifying the number of job titles from 7 to 4. It also began ranking employees based on their job proficiency instead of seniority. And as mentioned earlier, Samsung also changed the way employees called each other at the office by dropping the job title and instead using the honorific term name or pro, which is short for professional. And depending on the nature of work, employees were also allowed to use terms like sanbe or hube to address each other so they can still be respectful without rigid formality. But until now, the system did not apply to those in high-ranking positions like group leader, CEO, and other executives. And Samsung has finally decided to extend the policy to everyone starting this month. Aside from Samsung, top executives of other Korean Chebar companies have already joined the trend of dropping their title and using English names at work in efforts to get rid of corporate hierarchy and promote a more horizontal work culture. For instance, SK Group Chairman Choi Tae-won asked his employees to call him by his English name Tony instead of Mr. Chairman. And Lotte Group Vice Chairman Kim Sang-hyun asked his fellow employees to call him Sam instead of his job title. So why is this a big deal? For Samsung, it's a sign of the company's push for a more productive workplace. In November 2021, Samsung announced its mission to create a new Samsung that encourages creativity and respect among employees in all positions. And to achieve this goal, the company vowed to put an end to Korea's traditional top-down culture. Samsung CEO Han Jong-hee, who has asked his staff to call him JH instead of his title, has said that mutual respect among employees will lay a foundation for a horizontal workplace and calling each other by name instead of their job position could be a start.